Welcome back to the channel, guys. Owner Arna is here, the founder of Passionate Income. All right, uh, I get a lot of questions about, hey, how do you actually manage your team? How do you make sure your team is on point, posting posts on time, posting what's good, and how do you make sure they don't steal your profile uh, when you're posting, you know, when you give them access to the profile? and so on and so forth. So first of all, let me start off by saying, my name is Arnas and I'm the founder of this page, uh, Passionate Income and more. Uh, I have more pages, but I usually showcase Passionate Income and this specific page is ran by my team completely. I haven't posted here myself uh, or created any posts for around a year now and all of these are scheduled by my team. For example, this post with this long caption, they found something like that. You know, they made the post, they made the caption and they managed to post it two days ago and it did pretty well. It got 11,000 likes, a lot of shares. Um, how do I do that, right? How did I start doing that? Did I just start my page and immediately hired my team? No, for two years, I was posting myself I didn't miss a single upload for two years, uh, three times a day, posting every single day, not a single miss, like no matter what, even if I'm on a flight or whatever, I would land and then I would upload whatever I missed. So I never missed an upload in two years, just absolutely consistent. I would come up with my own posts, but around a year ago, I was like, you know what? I need to automate the process. I need team. I need a team uh, who's going to come up with the content and the captions and everything, who's going to schedule everything. So I don't need to even, even if they find the posts and send me the captions, I didn't even want to do that. I wanted uh, all the processes to be automated. And how did I do it? Okay. So first of all, I found um, first team member, which was a guy who's going to come up with all of these posts uh, and manage the content. Okay, that's it. And I tested him for around two months or three months. I was still uploading myself, but he was sending me all the content. He was like, okay, we're going to do three posts a day. Here's the content. Here's what you need to post. Here's the caption. Here's the content. You know, I would download the content from a Google Drive, post it manually. Still, I didn't want anyone at, to have access to my profile, right? Three months down the line, I was like, you know what? I want all of this automated fully. Like, even if it doesn't take a long time for me to post, like we're one step away to fully automate, uh, like automating this. So I started building the team and I was like, okay, let me start doing this. Uh, so first of all, what I did is I created a passionate income group chat on Telegram. You might say, well, why are you, aren't you using Slack? Why aren't you using Discord? Why aren't you using WhatsApp? I'm using Telegram because the people I work with when it comes to promotional shout outs, they usually send me the content on Telegram. Why Telegram? Because with a free version of Telegram, you can send files as big as two gigabytes, okay? So pretty much any post you're gonna post on your Instagram profile, you're gonna need to download, you know, that content or somehow get it, somehow receive it. And on WhatsApp, when you send a picture, usually it gets like worse quality. On Telegram, if you send the full file, it never gets worse quality. And under two gigabytes, like pretty much any post you're gonna post will be under two gigabytes. Like I've never probably uploaded a post more than two gigabytes on Instagram. Uh, I mean, it's possible, but 99.9% .9 of the time, Telegram is a great tool because I receive posts that I need to post for my clients on Telegram and I just send it over also to my team on Telegram. You can just forward the message, the whole message with the whole links, the whole content, the whole videos, whatever we're doing, I can just forward that to my team. So I was like, since I'm already working with all the clients on Telegram, and since Telegram is a great app, like I'm a Telegram supporter, I have the premium version, which is like $5 a month. 
I bought the yearly one, you know, I paid up front. I was like, I love this. Um, and there are some perks which come with that. But basically I run my team on Telegram and I have all my clients on Telegram too, because any post we need to send, we want to make sure it's the highest quality. Anything our clients want to send us, we want to make sure it's the highest quality. Hopefully that makes sense. And I created this channel on Telegram called Passionate Income. Uh, I have a general chat and right now it's not super active. It used to be way more active, but now everything runs very smooth. When I just hired these guys, I really needed to be on top of my game, kind of like manage them a bit uh, when I started. But we have a general chat, which just general stuff, you know, failed to publish. And I got a message, like an email from Flick. Hey, like we failed to publish. And I screenshotted this. And one team member uh, said, let's retry, you know, and tag the guy who's scheduling. Then I send them like, can you share the account reach country wise now? And we just chat about some stuff, you know? Um, so general chat, then I have PI promos. So you see, I forward all the PI promos and this was the most recent promo I did. I forwarded the pictures and I forwarded the caption and you know, one of my uh, team members said scheduling. I said, let me know once it's up. He sent in the link when it was up. I sent, I, I forwarded this link to the client. So to make sure like, okay, the post is up. Then we have an insights tab where I just send some insights. Uh, so sometimes, you know, like every 30 days or so, I send in some insights. I send in some wins and I have a stories chat, which is all, it's not being used that much. Uh, but basically I have a chat and uh, we use Flick for scheduling, okay? So I just did a video about Flick. Um, let me let me find that right now. Um, okay, so uh, I'm using Flick. Okay, it's here. Um, and in the workspace, basically, here I have the team members, the same team members in the Telegram chat. I have four team members, but two of them have access to Flick and they can basically schedule everything over here. Um, if you, we go to schedule, I think Deepak, uh, one of my team members scheduled this for today already. Um, sometimes they schedule a bit more upfront, sometimes less, but they do have access to, uh, they do have access to the profile, right? To the accounts but they have access to Flick. So they don't actually log in the account, okay? They don't actually log into the account. They just have access to a scheduling software, which is great, right? Like I'm the only one who has access to the Instagram. Uh, it's just my personal preference. I know a lot of people, they sign contracts. You can sign a contract, you know, and be like, okay, here's the logins. You can also do that, you know? Uh, there's a way to get a login link without actually showing the password of the page to your team. Like there's many ways you can do this. I just prefer them having access to the scheduling software on this specific page. On other pages, they have full access. They just log in on Instagram on their phones. So it's just your personal preference. I prefer to have access myself, full access, and then I prefer to give them limited access on this page when it comes to scheduling, right? Uh, also, how do I track their performance, right? So this is not being used anymore. Um, okay, so this is not being used anymore, but we used it for a few months when we started working to make sure we're on top of the game. So if you know what Google uh, <laughs> questionnaire is, uh, it's very simple. All of these answers go into a Google spreadsheet, right? So uh, daily management report for PI. So what the team member, uh, one of the team members would just choose the date, you know, for example, for yesterday. Uh, so post scheduled. So for example, we had um, four posts scheduled, but we only posted three. Uh, and, you know, they just need to post, uh, they just need to type in a number. Promo schedule, let's say we had two and we've done two promo done link. So we, 
uh, the the promos, let's say we did two promos, they would post in the link of the promos. CTA for, uh, okay, link, whatever. Um, CTA, we, we used to do uh, call to actions for my personal brand. Um, let's say zero and done zero. CTA is for newsletter scheduled, let's say one, and we did one. Story scheduled, let's say zero, and we did zero. And today's issues, let's say, okay, we had four posts scheduled, but we posted three. And uh, let's say Flick didn't work on the fourth post, okay? Today's wins, uh, we got 10, K likes on a CTA call to action of the newsletter, you know, whatever submit. And that's it. They submit that. And I see that in the back end, I see all the responses of every single day. So it's pretty cool. Right? You can just do that, uh, manage the whole team very simply. And right now I almost don't like, I don't deal with passionate income Instagram page at all. I just deal with the team sometimes. I'm just like, hey guys, how's it going? Uh, how how are we doing? Most of the time, I don't do anything when it comes to passionate income Instagram. I do do stuff more actively towards the newsletter now. But when it comes to Instagram, I, I let the team run it and that's it. Uh, so hopefully that was very informative for you. If you want to sign up for Flick, use the link down below in the description. I'll get like a kickback of five pounds or whatever off my next charge. So if you like the video, leave a like, leave a comment. If you want more in-depth stuff and you want to implement, maybe you have a page and you want to implement this yourself, reach out to me on Instagram. I'll give you more tips, uh, but thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel and see you in the next one.